Hello my friends and this is uh, yet another of my video we are having here musical fidelity M3 S CD CD player as you can see it has a um, nice um, CD text display which uh, down sounds logic and you know what you're listening to and next one is Crash and uh, Laura and so on. So what was wrong with it? What was wrong with it was that um, I bought it from a local site called Gumtree as a faulty unit and was in a workshop um, where the owner was told that um, that was easy enough fault to find that it was um, the signal was arriving at one of those uh, relays but wouldn't go any further and because it is and it's true high density board uh, won't cost a thousand dollars it'll take a couple of hours to do so I bought it and I put, uh, put a oscilloscope to it and indeed that was the case and just found one dry joint so put the solder blob there and a bit of heat and that's all. I also adjusted a bit of laser to make it read CDRs and this in fact is a um, my test CDR, very hard to read and that's why I'm using it. Um, in general it is not a spectacular mechanism, it's a uh, Sony, I'll turn it down a bit, KMH313AAM, just think it's used in DVD players as well. Uh, the DAC in here, and I only really bought it for the DAC, you mainly use it for streaming, was is a um, Burr Brown PCM1795, and it has the inputs and outputs. And the output, as you can see, it's it's pretty good, and nice and square. If you look at the single, there's a bit of overshoot here and there, but but the rising and falling edges are all vertical, so that's good. Plays nice, jumps to tracks. I won't even bother you with the tones. I just don't want to finish it quickly. As you see, it's uh, half past four in the morning. So I've been working on my computer and on this CD player at the same time. I had an antivirus software update and just stopped my computer dead. And because I fix computers as well, I had to do it. Well, thank you very much for your attention. I'll uh, put it on eBay for the 99 cent auction and we'll see where it will go. Uh, they, they go for about uh, just over a thousand, maybe fifteen hundred dollars. The, the owner paid two thousand seven hundred dollars for it uh, four years ago. Pretty good unit overall, you know. Even though it's it's modern and um, but you know works reliably, jump to tracks. One thing I got to tell you there, and which is sad, is that he dropped the remote control and the bottom cover there is cracked. But you know. But it works. Display, as you see, can be dimmed with the remote. And uh, that's it. Time, it only tells you how much time has elapsed in the track. Nothing more. Okay, well, thank you very much for your attention. And till next time. Bye-bye.